Hey guys, Bruno here. Welcome back to Fishing Barrent Sea. Here we are for episode number two. We're back in the dock area here at Hammerfest. We've got, um, quickly go to the map. Might be a little bit easier to show you guys. We've got a couple of boys here ready to go. So 19 hours and 21 hours. So we need to pick up both of those. Um, I did travel, as you can see, all the way up through here to Akaford, Akaford. Um, and I did pick up a job as well to bring some fish from there back to Hammerfest, which gave us 57,000 kroners, or credits, I think it's kroners. Um, so that's allowed me to upgrade my ship completely, or our little boat, I should say. It's not really a ship, but our boat is 100% done. So I'm going to quickly jump out of the sea and turn this fire off because you can see it shining through the side of the bloody boat. Um, in the outside camera view so what we're going to do is head out and head towards our lines and pick them up so over here so we'll come out and go right pick up our two lines and drop down our other two we've got as well um, I also unlocked the new ship so the next level up the next boat so we'll have a look at that when we come back into the dock and um, show you guys what it is so today we've got um, no chance of precipitation Five cloud covers, five octas, whatever that is. I have no idea what that means. And we're going to have zero kilometer hour winds and 9.9 .9 kilometer visibility. So line info, it's been out there for a while. 29 hours, 20 hours, which is good. We've got two 500 meter hook lines at the moment. Quotas. So we're, I'm a little bit worried about our redfish. We don't want to go over getting that, but Haddock and Pollock have still got heaps. Um, I was going to look at hiring somebody, but we can't hire anybody with the ship we've got. Well, it's not the ship, it's a bloody boat with the boat we've got, so... Oh, wow, this thing is pretty rickety once we get going. But I have upgraded... I'll turn these lights on. I've upgraded our searchlight and our mast and stuff like that, so you can see how bright it is now. I don't know if it makes any difference, to be honest, but um, it's upgraded. All our lights are on, so we can see. Oh, we can set our gear. How far away are we? We might set our gear in here somewhere. Let's have a look. Wait till we get down a little bit deeper, of course, but head over to those... Um, our first line and pick it up. Can't see any fish here at all yet, so I'll wait till we actually get some fish. And we'll drop it in here. We're in 25 metres, but oh, there we go. Might slow ourselves right down now. I don't want to catch any redfish, but. So I was right down to less than six knots. Chuck the line out. Hopefully we're not going to get too many of these redfish. We want to avoid as many as we bloody can. But there's our next line to pick up. There we go. That one's done. Let's so we'll run forward to the next one ready to um, pick up our next net and we've got to gut the fish. I was going to hire someone to gut it. We don't have enough room to hire anybody, unfortunately. So we can't hire anyone at the moment. Slow right down. There you go. Haul in the line. How many have we got on this time? 15 again. Ah, we don't want red fish. I'm not sure what that was. Oh, more redfish. If we go over this quota, we're going to be in trouble, I think. Can't tell if it's Pollock or Haddock. Haddock. Oh no, that's three redfish. Four redfish. Going to be in a bit of trouble, I think. 
Definitely going to go over our quota. I know when we do get this next boat, we will be able to go net fishing as well. Haven't done that before, so that'll be something a little bit new, and um, we can hire someone to help us as well. So, great. Oh shit, a lot of redfish. going to be a drama, I think. There's more redfish than anything else in there at the moment. Uh-oh. Alright, let's start the Uh-oh. let's start the gutting process. Beautiful. Wasn't too bad. Oh, that was terrible. That was terrible as well. Oh. We really suck at this. Exit. Uh, let's just drive from here. How full is our boat? About halfway full. Come on, power down. Head towards our next set of gear. So I don't know if we're going to put another line down at the moment unless we sort of yeah I don't know I'm a little bit worried about having we've got a 250 down already and we're already nearly full so a 500 is nearly going to fill us up so there's no point in setting another 500 because it's gonna we're gonna be overweight so you really need to split the lines up or just go 250s Obviously our gutted fish is probably not that great. It must be six tons in total we can carry now. We're still going forward down to this other boy which has been in there for 22 hours, so that's nearly perfection. Hopefully you guys have been enjoying it so far and um, hopefully you guys have picked up the game. The game is gonna be Pretty good. I know it's probably going it to feel it's going to be a little bit repetitive to start with, but once you get that money up um, and move up to that next boat, it's going to change. You'll be able to go net fishing. You'll have somebody working for you as well. So it's going to continue to progress once you get through um, past this boat, which isn't too bad. So we're okay, 2.6 tons of gutted fish on board. A lot of redfish. You can see our quotas, we're going to be well over that, I think. Cargo, how much fish we've got on board? One and a half tons of redfish. So that's pretty much what we're at. We'll be just under the quota, and hopefully we don't get any more redfish from up here. Then we'll be fine. If we get more redfish, we'll be in trouble, of course. I think you can see the boy, there we go, just there. You can just see it in the distance. I'm not sure if you guys can see it, but I can. up through there, we can still just see it, even with it shining off the, the mountains over here. How long has that one been down for? We want to try and space them apart by like say 12 hours or something. Which would be ideal, could probably just drive right around circles for a little while. Not us, but maybe fast travel for a little while. We go slowly, come up towards our net here with the buoy. There we go. Haul the long line. I need 12. Interesting. We had 15 on the other one, so. This is a little bit older too. Oh no, not the bunny redfish. 
Wish we could see what it was before we grabbed it. I'll just miss it. I wouldn't even like attempt to grab it. Because if you don't grab it quick enough and it goes red, um, you will actually miss the fish. I said if I could see if it was a red fish, I would just completely miss it. I only had, I think there's one or two red fish we've got now, so hopefully we're not going to get any more. Plus 45%, so I don't think we've missed one yet. Plus 50. A oh, bloody red fish, of course. Only good that time. In perfect, 58%. Yes, reach the yearly quota for redfish. Okay, yes, you want to gut the fish. Just need to sort of be smooth, there we go, smooth and a little bit fast. There we go. Let's go back inside. Sit in our seat and have a look. How much have we got on board now? Yeah, a little bit of redfish. So maybe that's why. Uh, we only got 316 kilos. So yeah, I'd say we probably put through some back. Haddock and Pollock. Not a great deal there, unfortunately. Got some good five stars there. So, all right, let's take off slowly. So what do we got? So two hours, so let's go like this, that, maybe down here, down here, down here, and then there, and fast travel. Six hours, so let's place some more waypoints. Do it again. That would nearly be perfect. Yep, that'll do. As fast as we can. Set the gear. Got that speed up a lot, which will allow us to pull this out a little bit quicker. Thirty meters. So we've got, yeah, it must be six tons that we can carry now. Beautiful. Set. So they're going to be 12 hours apart, so we can come in, go and grab that one, go back in, grab this one, go back in, and do that and keep them apart. I'm not sure about um, like how much that will give us. We need to go a thousand hooks now, or just stay at um, the 500 meters. I'm not sure. Meters, 500 hooks, I should say, not 500 meters. I'll right, we'll go to dock. 33,000, 13,000, and 11,000. So that's us up to 78,000. Port reputation, which gives us a um, bit of extra revenue. We'll just damage our boat then, too. So we're a hot shot fisher now. Uh, there's not much we can do. We'll show you we've, um, we can't hire anybody. I think we're going to hire Karen, won't we? But we can't. There's not enough room here. Um, we'll still get their 250 lines. Not sure if we should get rid of both of those and grab another two 500s. It costs a lot of money, but doesn't it? Um, let's not do that yet. Let's go back into our... Uh, bait. It's is it crab or yeah, I think it's crab. Or krill. Redfish is only five percent. What is it there? Five percent. The crab or mackerel. Do one of each. One crab, one mackerel. Why not? Um, we'll do. Crab, we'll bait one with mackerel. 
Go into town. There's nothing we can do there. We can't repay the loan yet. Nope. Uh, no jobs. No boat services. We'll go in here and grab fuel. Now we really need to skip a bit of time. Let's have a look at the map. How far is that? 14 hours. So we'll go 6 hours. We'll skip time. Uh, another 6 hours. We'll undock. Ready to reverse out and then power down. Get out of here. And head away. We'll get rid of this waypoint. That one there, there. Alright. There we'll do. Last travel those all the out, so 21 hours, so it's weird how it's um got that blue bar though. I mean we don't want to go too much longer, do we? There it is over there. So we'll go and pick it up and see how much we've got in there. Um we might pick it up and then drop a couple of lines here. A little bit after. I'm not sure how long I'm going to do the episodes at the moment because it's not um, overly exciting. It's just a bit of a grind to get started. Once we get started, we should be okay, I think. Haul the line, yes, please. Fifteen. It's good. Hopefully, we can um, build this up. We'll see how much we get out of this. If we only get, um, oh, that was only okay. Only get five hundred or well, halfway full. We'll probably go to the next line if we wanted to. The bigger lines. At least we know you can put two side by side or even do a, a 500 and a 250. Definitely not getting redfish, which is great. Well, as soon as I say it, we bloody get one, don't we? I'm definitely not going to target redfish when the quota is so low. There we go. Getting better, thirty-five percent. Got a screenshot. It's hard pressing two buttons at the same bloody time. One more to go, is it? No, two more. Fifty-one percent. I've only got one lot of redfish, which is great. Yes, we have. I know. Um, yeah, that's much better. Look at Pollock. Four, five. That's six. That's nearly. Oh, wow. I think that's nearly a boat full. I need to get better at this. This is bloody terrible. There we go. Up, down, up, down is way easier than doing that. Oh, I'm not shocking. <laughs> Beautiful. Look at that. Alright, let's go back inside. Get out of the rain. Let's have a look. So we're pretty much full. Wow, that was only one 500 line. That is awesome. Um, we haven't set any gear yet, have we? Uh, we can set one right here. We'll be absolutely fine. We'll get up to five or six knots and then drop a line. Chock a block full. It's awesome. Just have to wait till we hit five knots, I think. 
I'll even get there. Set the bait with the crab first, and then we'll um, do the next one. It's slowing us right down. Definitely need a bigger ship, boat, whatever. Right, we'll give it a bit of room, so maybe we'll go to here. Fast travel a little bit. We'll go back in here and we'll get our other waypoint set up, ready to go back to the dock. Probably, um, you guys really just need to let me know if you want to see fast travelling or not, or you'd rather me actually drive the boat to and from. I mean, driving it to and from like this is going to be pretty bloody slow, so you guys will probably get bored pretty quick. Right, put the next line down. Crab, mackerel, what's this one got? Can you see it? Mackerel as well, yeah, awesome. Okay, beautiful. Let's go to map and fast travel. Yep, something's blocking us right at the dock, awesome. I want to try and get this loan paid off. So 43,000, 24,000, and we got three kroners from one redfish. Nine kroners, I should say. Did they sell that or not? I'm gonna go uh, mackerel again. Actually, it didn't even sell. Why did it not sell the fish that we've got on board? Ah, go fishing. Yep. Dock. Ah, because I press cancel, you idiot. That doesn't help, does it? 66,000. Beautiful. Alright, go into town. We'll go to that. We will repay our loan. Yes. Borrow. We'll borrow 140,000. It's not going to help us, I think. Where are we? we'll go to dock. Uh, do that and that. Our upgrades are all done. Purchase boat. So we need the Jarkin. Can't turn the camera all the way around, but it's 450 a thousand kroners, so we really need to save a little bit more to get that. Um, it's a solid fishing boat with good sea characteristics. A large deck makes it suitable for fishing with long lines and nets. So that's max speed 15 horsepower, 7 knots. That's 75 horsepower, 16 knots, so that's going to be a lot better. 400,000 kilos total quota as well, so it's be much, much better for us. Let's go to the map. Look, 14 hours, so let's skip another 6 hours. Um, there's nothing else we need to do. Skip through another 6 hours. We'll go fishing. Try and get off this dock without smacking into anything. Alright, there we go. We'll go here. Whoops. Yeah, and then maybe there, and that's where we'll set our next line. Look at the weather, is it? Yeah, it's stormy today, very stormy. Eighty-six percent chance of precipitation. So be a lot of rain around. You need to head straight forward and grab our other line, which should be straight up here somewhere. Run our searchlight again, which for some reason keeps showing in backwards. Can we see them yet? I can't see them yet. Can't see nothing from this view. Uh, we'll turn that searchlight off at my help. I uh, can't see them yet. Let's go back into our um, quotas, so we're definitely 
smack bag on that. We've still got plenty of pollock, but not much haddock left, and heaps of cod, but I don't know where to get the cod from. It might be um, out in deep ocean because there's no cod here at all. So we're going to have to... Pollock. Haddock is what um, we're nearly done. So we're going to have to try and get some pollock now, I think. Oop, still got lots though, but... Yeah, fish around. Not, not even going the right direction. Whoa. We're gonna roll the roll the boat then. Not sure if I can't see it yet. Are we over here somewhere? Ah, oh, there it is. So we're coming in hot. Just slow it down and get ready to turn. Beautiful stormy day out in the open seas. There we go. Pull the line in. Only 12 this time. Perfect. We need to get perfect everything here if we can. Try and give us some more fish. Ah, it's only a good. Haven't got any redfish yet. Fingers crossed we won't get any. Oh, god damn. Every time I say it. Why do I say it? No more redfish. But it's a redfish. No, thank God for that. It's 10 out of 12. A couple more to go. We'll need to gut pretty well here as well. Beautiful. Um, yeah, not too bad. We won't, not going to be quite full, but... Not too bad. That's bloody terrible. So is that. Not getting any better, am I? Doesn't matter what we do, I'm still sucking at it. Oh, that was shocking. So we've got four and a half tons on board. So not quite full, but not bad either. We've got no more gear. So, we'll fast travel back to town again, I suppose. There we go. I think we want to get... It doesn't matter. Haddock, Pollock, whatever. 37,000. So I said I think we need like 600 or 700,000 to get that next, next boat upgrade. Dock, so that's 35, 18,000, pretty good, 45, it's not too bad. We're up to um, 80,000, so that gut was bloody terrible there. Um, gutting there was pretty, that was pretty good, gutting. That was better, the pollock would have been a lot better as well. We definitely need haddock, haddock is where the money's at compared to the pollock. So let's go back to the fish market. Let's go back here, Haddock. It's the bluey looking one. So the the um the one on the top right, I think. So crab, shrimp, yeah. So yellow best thing we're going to use is mackerel, but we're still going to get a lot of the other stuff. Oh, well, we'll go mackerel. Why not? 
Uh, fish prices, don't need to look at that. We'll go back into town. 410,000, is that enough? Not yet. Not far off though. If we get 410, that's 490. I think we need. Oh no, we can. Okay, let's do that. Bugger it, let's do it. Why not? Go back here. Let's go bank. Borrow that. Yes. Go here. We'll go. Let's buy Jachen. Sports net fishing. You can purchase these at the port. Also, sports up to one crew member. Yes. Okay, beautiful. Crew member. We'll get Karen Hamilton. Yes. Haven't got a lot of money though. Um, let's look at our dock. So. Upgrade our storage, upgrade our engine, radar, which I don't know really know what the radar does. Net haul is 20,000. So we can get that, but we won't have any nets at the moment. Have we got any? Have we got any lines? We've got two unbaited lines. Oh. Alright, we're going to have to do it. Mackerel and mackerel as well. Go to our map, how long have these got to go? 15 hours, 14 hours. So if we go... 4 hours? Sleep, maybe rest for 4 hours or something? And then we'll head out... on our brand new boat. Have a look inside while we're in here. We've got um, our little screen here with a sonar or a map, coffee. Uh, I'm not sure what that is. Maybe for the nets. We've got our, all our work lights and stuff. Call for Mayday, our throttle. Manage our crew. There we go. We can make her cook. Uh, what else is there? That's pretty much it for in here. Once again, we can stop driving though, and come out the back here, we can see her working away. Cooking up some meals, we've got our long lines here, and she does go in there to go below to rest. But, um, unfortunately, we can't go below deck on this boat. We can go up here. So we'll jump back inside, we'll um, leave the door open in case she wants to talk to us. She probably won't, but anyway. She's only doing 9.4 knots. Pretty slow, so let's fast travel again. I know we probably probably shouldn't, but we will. All right, fast travel, 20 hours, and that's 19 hours. So let's have a look at our crew. There we go. Still trying to work out how we know if she's tired. She hasn't cooked a meal yet. She's not bad at long line hauling. There you go, now she's cooked a meal, so she can go and rest. So, well, here's our line, I think. Something, if you give them something to eat, they, um, stop from being tired, so. Go long line haul. Actually, no, we'll go, she can go to gutting. We will haul it. She can gut it because, um,. I don't think they're very good at hauling, although she needs to do it to get better at it. So, but we'll I think we'll haul it. Just while we're desperate for the money. Oh, we don't want redfish. Actually, our quota might have gone up now. Okay, perfect. Thirteen percent. 23 so the more they do a task um, apparently the quicker they will um, increase their stats and stuff so if you have them just do hand gutting they will um, improve it over time We've only got one redfish at the moment. Fifty 
61%, which is pretty good. Could be a little bit better, but I'm not going to complain at all. 61%. We'll see how full we are once we finish this off. Alright, 155, 151, and 23. So she's gonna. How far off? Yeah, we're like nearly halfway full, so we're definitely gonna have to increase our um our storage. She's getting 45 fish per hour, so it's gonna take her a little while. I'm not sure if um. Oh, if I take her off, maybe I can gut fish from here. Let's have a look at the map. Um, set the gear here again. So I think, yeah, there's only 250 lines, so... There we go. Head straight down. Out the sonar the storage, so yep, our quota's increased, which is great on everything. You can go get some more redfish if you want to. Oh, she's not doing too bad at gutting, which is good. Better than what you bloody do. Keep heading forward towards this other one. Look at the map. We might go just a little bit further and put this other line down, so they're not too far apart. How's the weather going to be for the next few days? So a bit more rain on the Monday. A bit more rain on the Wednesday with 13 km hour winds. So it's going to get pretty windy. Let's set our gear now. I'm not sure that blue light... Oh, that must be every time she guts a fish. It goes up. Um, yeah, I'd say that's what it is. Still 45 an hour, so we need to monitor that number and um, see how she does. I think. Get rid of all these, we can try and grab a screenshot of our new boat. Where's this? Whoop! Where's the next line? Right over here. are not turning. There we go. Does it matter which end we pick it up from? I don't know. All the long line. So we'll continue to get her to gut for as long as she can, but we're probably going to have to gut anyway because they only do it to a certain speed. And I don't know if fast travelling um, while she's working will have her gutted as well or we have to just be in the boat while she's gutting. Beautiful five in a row. Sixth one, of course. Perfect. Only one lot of redfish so far, which is good. Even though we're capable of getting a lot more, so we can bait up for redfish next time. I think that missed the tub then. Not exactly sure how we do net fishing yet, but um, I've seen it being done, but yeah, I'm not sure how it actually works. Obviously, you don't bait the net, you just put the net out there and off you go. There you go, storage is full. She's still gutting. How is she going? Good. So, a stamina bar is pretty low, so let's give up. Can she eat it? No. I don't know. Anyway, let's try and head back. 
So say we've got 495 kilos, let's go to here. What do we got now? Yeah, it still does it. She's still she's still working away, so she's not gonna eat that. Alright, let's put down another waypoint here. She's too tired to work. Now will she eat it? There she goes, she's eating. to hurry up and eat so she can get back out of here and do a bloody job. Uh, we'll go down to here. Oh, she's still resting, which is a shame. Still a lot to guard, so... Repairing, so they can repair the ship as well, or the boat as well, which is good. Oh, I think we're just going to have to travel in and She's still resting, so so we're gonna have to do it ourselves, unfortunately. Oh, terrible! Perfect. Why can't they be like that every time? Oh, didn't push far enough to the right. Just go across as fast as you can. I think there's a way to go. Right, everything's gutted. Let's head on in. See how much money we make. So she's resting. You see a little green bar there. Is that's a stamina? So she hasn't got a great deal of stamina, unfortunately. Don't know if that can improve or not. The more she works, I'd hope so. All right, let's go, Doc. Uh, got a little bit of money, 60,000. Made 31,000 out of Pollock. It's only 8, they're yeah, 9.1 kilos of little ones. So the money is still in the redfish. So let's go straight into the fish market. So they were... They were two 250s, weren't they? Okay. I think what we're going to do now is dock. Let's go. Uh, net hauler. Yes. Um, storage upgrade. And that's about all we can do, I think. I want to get the radar upgrade. We need to purchase previous on first. Well, that sucks. We'll do both of those. Um, I'm not going to purchase that. Maintenance will fill her up. Uh, go back into here. So he's got a lot more stamina, but he's terrible at everything. Uh, we can't take out another loan. Um, okay, so if we happen to destroy our boat, reimbursement 40% value of the boat for 18,000 per year or this one is 50% 60% if you sink your boat if your boat sinks you will not be reimbursed at all okay. all right I think I'd like to call it an episode there I know we're pretty excited we just got our um, nets but we'll have to um, head out and grab these so let's skip through Oops, skip through 17 hours. Well, they're both at 20 hours, so by the time we get out there, they'll be good to go. And then we'll be able to do some net hauling. So I might go out and get these off camera, and then next episode we'll come back and do some net hauling. So hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, as always, smash that like button, leave a comment, and let me know what you think of the game so far. If you've got an idea for the name for the boat, leave it in the comment section. Um, probably the most creative or the best name put there will name the boat after like that name or you or whatever whatever you want to do I said idea for the boat name put it in the comment section if you haven't subscribed yet guys please do so make sure you hit that bell to receive a notification every time we upload and uh, don't forget every Friday 6 p.m. Australian Eastern Daylight Savings Time Sydney time is our episode of Fishing Barrent Sea that's been Brito's Gaming thanks for watching 
see you again soon.